I'm Simon Nunn, Global Marketing Director for Molecular Spectroscopy at Thermo Fisher Scientific, and this is the new Nikolai IS50 FTIR spectrometer. It's a highly modular materials analysis system, um, capable of everything from near-infrared, mid-infrared to far-infrared, and in this case we've also got Raman. Why do we have so many techniques built in here? Well, it turns out that when you're characterizing a very complex sample, such as a, um, a, a plastic, um, which may contain a base polymer, um, fillers, plasticizers, and what have you, um, one technique is seldom enough to, uh, to truly characterize that, that sample. So um, with this system, we can switch between those techniques um, extremely quickly. Um, the system starts with a research grade FTIR spectrometer and can be built out from there as the, as the customer needs to add capabilities. Um, the system we have here um, is a very well equipped system. Um, we have a near infrared module over here, um, which is a great choice if you're wanting to do quality control on um, powdered samples such as these. Simply place the vial on top of the sphere there um, and obtain the spectrum. Um, the system also um, contains a um, beam splitter exchanger here where we can change the um, wavelength range uh, at the push of a button. So this particular system we can go from near um, to mid to far infrared simply at the push of a button. Uniquely, um, the IS50 can, um, can be equipped with an in-sample compartment um, Raman accessory. This is extremely compact, um, which means it has a, a short beam path for very good signal-to-noise performance. Um, the sample is introduced um, through the front of the instrument here. Um, there's a nice little video camera that points down at the sample, so you can see the sample that the, the Raman um, laser is pointing at, making it extremely easy to locate the sample and obtain a very good um, Raman spectrum of it. That accessory, um, of course, being in the sample compartment, um, can be easily re removed and replaced with any standard infrared um, sampling accessory that would fit in the main sample compartment of, a, of an FTIR spectrometer. Um, the most common um, sampling technique in FTIR is actually ATR. Um, attenuated total reflection. It is an incredibly easy technique to use um, and would traditionally be introduced into a spectrometer uh, by housing an accessory in the sample compartment. Um, with this system, however, um, we've um, integrated an ATR actually into the purged uh, enclosure of the instrument. Um, this means that the ATR is always ready to go, so a 30 second um, experiment, which is what ATR should be, will always take 30 seconds. Um, you're not going to need to pull out an accessory um, and, and put an ATR in there to run that quick ATR spectrum. Um, that's particularly useful in a system such as this, which is um, very often used in research environments, where you may have a larger accessory, um, such as a Raman, um, in the sample compartment, and you don't want to um, extract that and place an ATR accessory in simply for that 30 second um, quick run. Again, it starts with a very basic system and can be built up from there. Um, we also offer hyphenated techniques such as infrared microscopy, uh, GCIR, and TGAIR can, uh, can be added to the system. Um, so very much um, builds out to that complete um, materials analysis workstation. When one sampling technique isn't enough or one spectral range isn't enough, this has you covered from near to far infrared and, and even Raman.